Hey guys, it's me, Nuha, and today I'm going to be showing you guys um, how to animate on actually Procreate Pocket, not Procreate, because I have a phone, so. <laughs> Anyways, um, before we get started, please follow me on TikTok. My user is IVIS Paint Execute one and also subscribe to my YouTube channel, please click the thumbs up and hit that notification bell so you get notified every time I upload a new video. Anyways, without further ado, let's get on with the video. So first, obviously, you're gonna have to enter Procreate Pocket and you're basically gonna um, add a screen size canvas. Like if you want your GIF to be big. I'm just doing this for demonstration purposes and yeah. Anyways, um, we're gonna be using black. And this, in this one, um, I'm gonna be doing like, uh, all right. I'm just gonna tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do like a, ba a ball, a ball, bouncing, um, bouncing, um, on like the ground and then, off the page again it's gonna be like really really cute and yeah anyways i hope you guys like it so now that we're done with the ground i just filled it in we i'm gonna go to the new layer we're gonna do another ball but this time i'm gonna choose a color this nice um light blue and so first of all, we need to draw the ball, obviously. And this one, I think I'm gonna change the brush. So, yeah. I'm gonna go to calligraphy, go to monoline. And I'm just gonna click monoline, obviously. Anyways, so yeah, just go up there and just, you know, um, make that into a circle. And yeah, every time we do a circle, we're gonna do a new layer, but the previous circle obviously was off the page because I wanted to give it more volume. If you guys really, really want to do um, the same thing as me, um, basically this is how you do it. I'm not, actually, I'm not gonna color it in because I want it to have like a 3D, not really 3D, but like, a clearish effect i don't know but yeah um i'm gonna change that into a circle like that it doesn't um necessarily have to be that big or that small as you can see i actually changed my size anyways now that i'm gonna draw the ball actually this time it's gonna be different again so i'm just gonna draw like the ball here and but this time we're gonna be drawing like lines so it actually shows that the ball hit the ground but but this time actually we're gonna be using black to do that so yeah Anyways, um, so now that we have that down there, we're gonna get black again. I know. You guys probably are like, wait, why are you using black? I'm actually gonna use it to, as you know, it's basically gonna create like that, that like, that hitting the ground effect. I'm creating it near the balls because I just want it to, um stand out i'm guessing i don't really know how to say it so yeah now we're gonna add a new layer and obviously draw another ball but this time it's gonna be halfway off of the page oh my god i just forgot <laughs> i'm using the blue okay hopefully we can do like modify and make it blue we can't oh. well this is horrible Anyways. I 
guys i'm actually uh, for my next video um i decided i'm gonna be trying i'm actually gonna give you a head start on what i'm gonna be drawing so for my next video i'm gonna be drawing a um butterfly like it's basically a sunset and then like a butterfly tree butterflies and tree trees like yeah like ever evergreen trees and then for like my other video i'm gonna be um showing you how to drop not really draw but like how to color in um like how to just make it your own color like the text your own color you're gonna see what i mean by that anyways now we're gonna go to modify we're gonna click this tools right here you're gonna click on share and down here it's gonna be share layers you're gonna do animated gif and you can actually choose how slow that will be i'm actually gonna do something um that might not um that actually kind of will shock you i'm going to add this um bottom base in like every single one of my um pictures i'm guessing I don't really know what you guys call it, but yeah. I'm just going to say pictures for now. And I'm going to fill it in. You guys are like, why are you doing that? Now, the reason why I'm doing this is because, um, as you all know, um, <laughs> like, if you want to, um, sort of kind of, I'm just gonna go ahead and say this. It's, it might sound weird, but yeah. See, if you don't put the ground in every single like layer, then your GIF won't really turn out as well. So if you want to make your GIF turn out as well, you will be needing um, like this ground thingy. Yeah, I'm just gonna call it that for now, for now. Now that I fill that in, we're just going to go ahead and do this with every single layer. You guys know it. Anyways, guys, let me know in the comments what you guys want to um, see me draw next. Or um, what you what. Um, it could be what you want me to draw next or what you like about the video. Or it could just actually even be like... Um, what you what um like if you try it and it worked for you yeah basically all all those sort of stuff now you guys are gonna be like wait why are you why do you keep keep on clicking that um you know the like how how much colored it's gonna be i'm just gonna say that for now the reason why i'm actually doing this is because um it just i just have to make sure it just does it for every single one anyways i'm adding like a background color so i'm just gonna click the background color layer go with this light pink here it's very, very nice and you know baby pink <laughs> i don't know what to say we're gonna go to modify again go to the tools anime gif as you guys can see um, it depends on how fast you want it to be. I'm going to put it like that. And I don't. I actually don't want a transparent background. Next, you're going to push full resolution. It's going to be exporting. Now, all you're going to do is... Um, you see this row below where everything's gray? You're going to scroll and you should see save image. And it should export successfully to your... Um, photos or your like your camera and that's exactly how the gif is gonna look anyways if you guys enjoyed this video please like and subscribe and follow me on tiktok my user again is ibi's paint execute one and hopefully i'll be able to give people shout outs hopefully and yeah bye